Oh no, there ain't no rest for the wicked. Money don't grow on trees. We got bills to pay. We got mouths to feed. There's nothing this life for free. Oh no, there ain't no rest for the wicked. Until I can't remember the tone of that that tune of that song because I've listened to it so many goddamn times. What's going on, guys? The Inhuman Beatdown, and I'm back with more Marvel Avengers Alliance. Uh, do not be deceived by the image in front of you. It is truly a fake. Despite the fact that the stuff is going... Okay, no, it's not a fake! New Spec Ops is here! There's a new Special Operations available agent. Play now and unlock Ant-Man! An exclusive new re weapon. Weapons, I said... I almost said rewards. Not now. Not now. Cool. What the hell is this? Pym Tech Component. Cool. The Helmet. <laughs> I don't know why you call this. It is called the helmet now. It may not be activated manually. Wow. Wouldn't it be fucking lucky if I got it? I'll take that. I'm probably going to need those fucking things. Cool. I'll take that. Uh, yes, I forgot and missed a day. My shame is now exposed to everyone. I didn't play Marvel for a day. How shameful of me. I know. There we go. Anyways, so, 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 so. We should not play Spec Ops. That seems like a very good idea. And what the fuck are we talking about? Anyways, um, let's do a once over brief over of Mr. Scott Lang. There is thankfully no lockbox. We'll probably save that for the next one, which will probably be Spider Verse. This is a new character, though. This is just a straight-up new character. Who the fuck is Quake? Quake, personally recruited by Nick Fury, uh, Daisy Johnson, codenamed Quake, is one of the few special agents in S.H.I.E.L.D. that have director's complete trust and orphan child. Daisy only recently learned her true, true lineage. Her mother had latent inhuman genes, and her father is the terrible supervillain Mr. Hyde. Thank God, because I didn't see Hyde there, and I just saw Quake, and I was about to say, oh, please don't tell me his name is Mr. Quake. Built the ability to generate powerful vibrations that can target the smallest of organs or create earthquakes. Oh my God! I was about to say, oh, great, she's just a cheap knockoff of fucking, uh, Avalanche. Great. She's an incredibly smart and resourceful agent, has even been representative of S.H.I.E.L.D. as a member of the Avengers. Cool! Well, welcome to the team! Quake! Recruited! Wow, alright. It's good to finally meet you, Agent. The Director speaks highly of you. Just pro tip, if anyone asks you if you want a vacation, don't go to Tahiti, okay? I don't get it. Cool! I now have... Five people that need leveling. Good A. All right, let's go get another one so I can have six. All right, all right, all right. Cool. We didn't even take a look at Ant Man. I don't even care. Let's get into this. Let us get into this. Good thing this happened on a day I was home from work. Makes me happy. Ah, Yellow Jacket, you look beautiful. Can I, can I call you beautiful? You look beautiful. Darling. Taskmaster? Really? Huh. Well, I did always say that we want to fight the uh, Logbox heroes again, so because that's good. All right. Uh, chapter. Welcome to Enter Ant Man. Ant Man. Say your prayers, little ones. Don't forget my son to include everyone. I took you in along with me. Keep you free from sin till the Ant Man he comes. <laughs> I couldn't resist. It was perfect. It was fucking perfect. <laughs> 
A raid on Hank Pym's research facility threatens to unleash unproven technology on the streets of San Francisco. With his personal research and pride on the line, Hank will not want assistance with containing the breach. But he's going to need it as Whiplash and Yellow Jacket arrive on the scene. Thankfully, a little help comes from the inside as one of the thieves in the facility rises to the challenge, becoming Ant-Man. What? <laughs> So, Scott Lang is a thief? I guess? Is that gonna be a thing? Is that really gonna be a thing? Chance be immune to ant attacks. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Well, without further ado, let's get into this. Uh. Yeah, let's do this. I assume I have everyone. I have everyone who's unlockable. So, Agent, put your team together. We've got an armor-piercing SOS from Hank Pym. His research lab is under attack. Seems to be servo guards and aim power armor suit leading the way. We'll update you as we get surveillance teams in place, but you should get going now. There are plenty of things in Hank Pym's lab that we don't want falling into the wrong hands. Where did, uh... Where did Fury go to? That's my only question. All right. Fisherman's Wharf, cool. So we just gotta take out five servos, alright? Any hero! Send a hero to evacuate the uh, civilian employees of the business around Pym's lab. Uh, this looks like a job for an American hero, Agent Venom. Alright, these two will be enough to get it to me, so... Uh, Quake's a tactician, if I recall, so we'll bring her to uh, fight this, because I want a chance to test her out. And now begins the flood of everyone messaging me, telling me, Spec Ops is live! Spec Ops is live! It's like, I fucking know! I only needed one person to tell me. I guess no one thinks that no one tells me this. Oh. You know what? Let's bring, let's bring, a uh, Superior, he still needs experience. All right. Uh, what can she do? Chance to gain rising up after anyone's sonic action. Okay. Uh, chance to evade ranged attacks. That's pretty cool. And I'm going to see if they finally fix the infiltrator armor. Because if they have, I have another video to do after this video. Alright. So. Infiltrator, dear friend. How are you? Let's find out, shall we? And if you don't, well, I can rely on these two to basically break everything for me. More s I don't actually know. Nothing else. I've got abilities to back me up. Oh my god, I've got like probably a dozen notifications. I've got two people trying to message me. Boy. Who will go first? I will go first. No, it's still broken. Cool. Alright. No real loss. Goes blade. Laser blast. Fuck you, because Spider-Man gets to go now. Or Superior gets to go. Bumbling! <laughs> Bumbling! Thank you for the unstabilized weight. Don't worry, I got this. I can tank it. And this will do flanked. Grand attacks against this target deal extra damage. Combo setup. Cool. Frack attack! I don't know what that means, but whatever. <laughs> it's actually kind of cool. It's like martial arts with uh, fucking sonic attacks. Superior swing. That'll cause fatal blow. Not that he's not already dead anyways. Close line. Fuck you. Absorb your energy. And frock attack. Because I didn't look at any of her moves before this. But whatever. She seems to be doing pretty good right now. I lost a turn. Superior armaments! Alright, that went pretty well. <laughs> well enough for a first fight. Alright, well, I need to get back in my suit. A black cat. 
<laughs> We've located a signal booster that we think is controlling the servo guards, but it's protected by laser arrays. Black Cat's ideally suited to put her thieving finesse to work here. Black Cat, we found a transmitter that we think is controlling many of the servo guards. Problem is, it's got bank vault security, laser detectors, that kind of thing. You mean my kind of thing. It'll be unplugged before you know it. Good to, good to know, I guess. Alright. These ones are basically more of the same. Alright. Well, Quake, you did good, but I need to get you up a couple levels before uh, you really become useful for to me. Useful to me. In the meantime, uh, Victor, you are ideally suited to take out... How do I say this? Uh, people of the mechanical persuasion. There you go. Let's get back my weapons. I require my blade. Scroll is fine. Uh, glaive won't help me much here because they're mechanical, so instead... the hell is my hammer? Uh, oh, that's not it. Uh, you know what? Damn it. Oh no, is it sledge? Yep, there it is. Oh, P-N. Alright. I hate trying to spell that damn thing. Psychic Amplifier, thank you. Let's get to work, shall we, team? Good. Go to here, we're all on the same side. Well, I'd hope we were all on the same side, hopefully. Maybe. I don't know. Hammer time. <laughs> Stop. Hammer time. Let's pick your webbing. Mnemonic Sledge. Magnet Man. Thank you for all of that beautiful chain lightning. <laughs> Dragon Claw. That's right. <laughs> chain lightning them to death. And I'll have Superior take out this one. Because Fatal Blow will kill him. Apply the magical psychic amplifier. I think myself and yeah, cool. Myself and uh, Superior got the buff. Victor, not so much. <laughs> now one little lone servo guard stands to be in my way. Fortunately for him, he's now no longer in my way. Now he's just trash. Mess with the best, die like the rest. You suck! Okay. I don't think it's gonna kick me out this time. Or at least it's gonna wait until I finish the mission to do so. Cool. All right, finally. Use Hank Pym in combat. Thing I got Hank Pym! We're trying to track the signal controlling the servo guards, but radio teams are coming under heavy attacks. Send a hero to protect them. Angela. Sensors near Pym's live have detected a radiation leak. Send a hero to check it out, beast. <laughs> Is that another power armor, or does Pym have a reactor in his lab? I don't. Good to know. Alright, cool. Alright, Quake and Pim. You guys get to work together. Be sure to play nice now. Where the hell is Pim? I think he's back. Yep, there he is. Hank Pim, come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. And by The Price is Right, I mean... Crush them, please. Thank you. <laughs> Two extra turns for everyone. Everybody gets a turns except for me. I don't get turns. Whatever. Right. 
Which one of these has fumbling? This one does. Boom, Goliath Punch. Falcon Punch! Falcon dead. And finally, Frack Attack. Won't kill him, but whoever he attacks will kill him. Hank it is. <laughs> Right. Cool. Yay. Use tank pim in combat. Alright. Use two distress calls. It's a very awkward or very weird things it wants me to do. Alright, um we're actually gonna bail from here. We're gonna go to a regular fight. And use my two distress calls, cause I don't have to be in no, uh, fucking whatever to use my distress calls. Mm -mm. Damn it! I already killed Viper. Shit! I was gonna go get Quake one turn, one uh, level by taking her to fight Viper. <laughs> Curses! They found out my plan. Um, that's the case then. Fuck it. We'll go back to mission one. Yep, mission one it is. Cool. I don't even care. And then we'll end the episode off after this. Blah, blah, blah. Energy signature is something, something. Something I've already covered. Let's, let's do a fight. Yeah! Just fighting stuff, huh? And for ultimate choice. Yeah. Actually, Kate, I never did get you that four ex or seven experience you needed. Cool, let's go take care of that. That way, Quake can immediately replace you as someone to a as uh, someone who needs to level up. You guys have like like her her hair is a little bit messier than yours. Aside from that, you guys are basically like the same character. Ah, I'm dead now. But oh shit, I almost forgot. Stress call. Bioelectrical pistol. Is that really what that thing looked like? Shit. All right. Cause sharing is caring, and caring means oblivion. There we go. Get that back. Of course, the Ant-Man stuff comes right right up after I just re recorded the uh, Ant-Man stuff for Future Fight yesterday. It's kind of funny, actually. Superior, you get to help. Why? Because you also need experience. It's literally the only reason. <laughs> and stress call. Deathlock. Cool. Someone else I hope to get. Thank you, Deathlock, you made this super fucking easy for me. He's just like, man, these bitches ain't nothing. Bzzzoop, laser beam. Oh, I have to collect distress. Oh. Oh, no. I don't think I can collect two distress calls. Well, it looks like we're going to have to end things off here. <laughs> well, so until next time, guys, I'll catch you all later. Asta!